From what some say is a problematic turf field behind me to the food court, to private locker rooms, lounge space, and workout areas, Spooky Nook took us on a tour today to show us what it says is still a world-class facility. Women field hockey Olympic hopefuls have played and practiced here at Spooky Nook Sports since it opened in June 2013. Construction of the facility was modified to accommodate the U.S. team. But after a recent petition, started anonymously but signed by thousands, alleged rotten food and undercooked food, plus subpar playing fields, the sports complex is now fighting back. It walked News 8 through the kitchen space where more than 12,000 meals have been specially made for the team over the last six years. Spooky Nook says it only ever received two food-related complaints. As for the playing turf, on the outdoor pitch, Spooky Nook says it's playable but not aging well. It's under warranty and going to be fixed. Oh, I really would hope they'd know that we were going to replace that for them. I mean, uh, I, that's, that's what we do. We make everything as, as great as we can for them. You've been here for six years. We like you as a partner. We're interested in the, in the success of the team. How can we make that happen for you? Um, and so whatever that end result ends up being, I think, you know, that's up to USA Field Hockey at this point. Executives here at Spooky Nook and for the team have not made it clear if the women will remain here at the Spooky Nook Complex. In Lancaster County, I'm Meredith Jorgensen, WGAL News 8.